ready? I'm gonna give y'all. I'm gonna give y'all another minute to strategize. Another minute to strategize. Concrete, the ground, the earth, right? This circle represents a lot of things to a lot of different people, right? If we go back to the indigenous times that Juan was talking about it, we talk about people staying in a circle to console ourselves, to talk about things, to work things out within our tribe. We're all diverse. We got a couple of different backgrounds and different ethnic groups and different problems and struggles we face, but the one thing that we all had in common is that we all struggled at one point in time with something. And they pretty much are using those thorns, as we say, to uh, make something beautiful. It's unique because we start to learn new things about different parts of our society. I'm hoping to achieve just a start of a conversation, a step in the right direction. I hope to gain more uh, social skills and more, just to give back to my community. Uh, the main thing that really got me into the program was the retreat. It's giving me a space to actually like talk about issues and actually uh, make something positive out of it. Uh, they taught me to take my disadvantages and not let people use it against you, use it as strength. And now today I'm comfortable telling my story with other people. Oh, well, one of my favorite memories of being in part of the fellowship is definitely the conversations we had when we were discussing our policy briefs. Like we, we would joke around sometimes, but um, at the end of the day, we will always know what our goal is and what we're striving to do. If I could sum this up in one word, it has to be brotherhood. brotherhood. It's something that you, you work with and it's something that you create, not in the first day or in a couple of days. It's something you build throughout the whole nine months.